Mm. <laughs> oh, hello there, everyone. <laughs> Jedi Master Yoda here, and today I will show you how to cook coffee. <laughs> coffee is a very important part of my roommate's day at the start of his day. Oh, and today, make a special cup of coffee just for him, I will. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. So, this is a kettle. <laughs> and when you fill it with water and then turn on the stove, it will boil the water. And once you boil the water, you can then proceed to the next step in cooking a fresh pot of coffee. <laughs> this is the tip of the kettle. And once you open this little nozzle, you can fill it with water. Or as I like to call it, H2O. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Now, for the next step in cooking a pot of coffee, you're going to want to use this device. And for those of you who do not know what this device is, this is called a kitchen sink. Oh, once activated, water will spew out of this nozzle. Now, I will show you exactly how I activate the kitchen sink. And what I like to do is leave the water running for about 45 minutes because it will make for a funny reaction from my roommate at the end of the month when he receives the water bill. <laughs> And sometimes, depending on the hour of the day, turn on the bathroom sink and the shower faucet, I will as well. So then we have a triple threat. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh, heavy this is. Water that is. Make sure you turn off the water, otherwise a flood might occur. We have now reached the next phase of this video, and as you can see, I have placed the kettle on the stove, and I have turned the stove on, and to know if the stove is on or not, simply look at the red dial, because red, like the color of the Sith lightsaber, will indicate that the surface is now hot, and I advise you not to touch the surface, because many terrible things will come from doing so, and hurt yourself, you must not. But anyways, soon the songs of the kettle will be sung, and a personal favorite of mine that song is, because it's like a mother hearing a baby cry for the first time. You simply go, ah, oh, oh, and soon we will, <coughs> and soon hear that song we will, oh, <laughs> If listen you do, then surely hear some sounds you will. Oh, oh, there it is again. A sizzle and a crack. A snap, crackle, and pop. <laughs> Let's get a closer look at this. <laughs> hear that, do you? The sounds from within the kettle indicate that the water is boiling. And this means that soon, hear the songs of the kettle, we will. <laughs> and sing along to them, I will, in a style of singing known only as harmonization. Ooh, here it comes. <laughs> Remove it, I should. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Now on 
to the next stage of cooking your coffee. Once you've succeeded in boiling your water, and once the songs of the kettle have been sung, you can proceed to the next stage, which involves instant coffee. Oh, unfortunately, my roommate had to go with the no-name brand because cheaper it is, and unfortunately, poor he is because too busy paying the water bill he is and always complaining that expensive the city that we live in has become. <laughs> what can I tell you, bud? Go get a better job. Am I right? <laughs> Anyways, here we go. We will now use this instant coffee to complete the process of cooking our coffee. <laughs> this lid would be better if green it was. <laughs> Anyways, for this next step, this is very important. But after removing the lid, I like to stare at the coffee so that it knows that I am the one in charge. <laughs> Here's Yoda. <laughs> oh, so precious you are. <laughs> Looks like the intro of every 007 movie this does. Oh, anyways. Begin the process of disintegrating this coffee, I will. Oh, oh, almost forgot. It's always important to take a good whiff of the coffee before you disintegrate it. Oh, 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 oh. Mm, like this coffee, I do. Oh, Perhaps my roommate is onto something by purchasing the cheaper brand. <laughs> the next stage of this process involves a mug, specifically a coffee mug, which is usually kept behind the blast doors behind me. <laughs> Let's get one now. <laughs> hmm? What's this? A mug with... Me on it? But this version of me does not look like me. Oh, perhaps my roommate drinks from this mug because when I am not around, it reminds him of me. Oh, very sweet that is. Sweet like chocolate. Oh, well, surely if this is his favorite mug, then use this mug. I will. Oh, hmm? Attack? A Jedi never uses the Force for attack, only for knowledge and defense. Oh. Mm. 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 Now that I have picked out the right mug to use, we will now add the coffee into the mug. The reason I am adding the coffee first and then the boiled water after is because... I prefer when it smells like burnt coffee rather than, well, regular coffee. <laughs> and a spoon is not required for this next step because we can simply eyeball it by lifting the jar. I use an entire jar. Mmm, yes, 150 grams is exactly how much you will need when cooking a cup of coffee. But for now, this will have to do. <laughs> it's now time to add some H2O. Oh, there we go. And I always leave some room for some dairy. Oh, oh, dairy is Yoda's favorite. Mmm, mm. mm. delicious this is. Half and half cream. <laughs> Just the right amount. And now for the last ingredient, a little bit of sugar. Mmm. 
successfully cook a cup of coffee. <laughs> now, let's summon my roommate because surely he will enjoy this. Roommate! Roommate! Hmm. Never home he is between the hours of 7 in the morning and 4 in the afternoon. Wondering I am where he always goes. But anyways, Sit here, this cup of coffee will, and if he gets home and cold it is, then his own problem that is. Mm, mm, because slave all day I do to make this for him, and the least he could do is be here to receive it. But nevertheless, it will remain here, and I will go over there. Enjoy your cold coffee, you will. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> to be continued. <laughs>